1, the diagram on the right shows a bit moving along a curve with equation of this one. So we have equation of the curve. We can see it from our diagram. At A, the rate of change of x is 3 unit per second. So here 3 unit per second, it is dx over dt. Why dt? Because corresponding to time. Because we are talking about unit per second. So dx over dt is given as 3 unit per second. Find the rate of change of corresponding y. So find dy over dt. So we have a graph, right? So from the graph, we can get... We have graph of y is equal to half 1 over 8x square. So, so dy over dx is equal to... So you bring forward 1 over 8 times 2 x 2 minus 1 is 1 you don't really need to write 1 so this one you can divide get 4 1 over 4 x so this one is dy over dx so what is the relation between these three so we know here that we have dy over dx is equal to so this one is dy right this one must also be dy so we have additional dt here so this one is dt times dt over dx can you see this so you see here when you eliminate when you eliminate dt you can get dy over dx which means on the left and on the right is equal. So if you know this okay so now you see you have dx over dt so you have dy over dt dx over dy but here you have dt over dx. So to make it dx over dt you bring it to the other side so when you bring it to the other side, this side we are left with dy over dt is equal to this side we have dy over dx, right? So when you bring to the other side, multiply will become divide dt over dx. So this one dy over dt is equal to dy over dx. So when you divide fraction, multiply dx over dt. Basically, you don't need to remember this. I mean, if you know this one, you can get this one but if you want to just remember this one also okay so we just substitute so dy over dt so dy over dt is what you wanted to find okay so dy over dx is this one but here you have x here so we see here this one is at a for 2 which means x is equal to 4 so when x is equal to 4 dy over dx is equal to 1 over 4 4 which is equal to 1 So here dy over dt is equal to dy over dx is 1 and dx over dt is given in the equation which is 3. So here you get 3 which is the unit is in 3 units per second. So the same thing as this one, units per second. Because why? Why in term of time second? Alright. 2. The area of a square with side XCM increases with this one. So here we have this one, right? So we have a square where the side of X. So we have X. Because it is square, every side is equal. So increases at a rate of, you see here, centimeter square per second. So it's talking about area. So dA over dT is equal to 8 centimeter second per second find the rate of change of its side when the area is 4 cm so how to get it so this one is dA over dt so we must make a relation so we know that side and area can be related by area is equal to x square where dA over dx is equal to so dA over dx is equal to 2x so now we have dA over dx. So how can we relate everything? So here we have dA over dx. Okay. It seem, it's almost similar with number 1. So this one is dA. This one must be dA. So we see here we have additional time. This one must be d. This one must also be dt. See up and down must be similar. And here we have dx. So we don't want dx to be down here. We bring to the other side. So here will become dA over dt is equal to dA over dx. So you bring to the other side. You have to divide, right? So now you have the equation that you wanted to find. This one is t, t is equal to dA over dx times dx over dt. So... 
So the question want to find the rate of change of its side. So rate of change of its side side is given as x, which means the question wanted to find dx over dt. So as long as we have this one, we can just substitute. So here when the area is equal to 4 cm, so here we know that a is equal to x square, right? So when the area is 4 cm, so x is equal to 4, which is equal to 2. Because the side cannot be negative. So now we know that x is equal to 2. So when x is equal to 2, dA over dx is equal to 2 times 2, which is equal to 4. So now we know that here, dA over dx is 4, right? So dA over dt is given as 8. And then dx over dt is what we wanted to find, dx over dt. So here dA over dt is 8 is equal to 4 times dx over dt. So we want to find dx over dt. We bring to the other side 8 divided by 4. Here we get 2. So we know that this one is in centimeter per second. Because see the unit is centimeter square for area. So this must be centimeter per second.